Russia concentrates 150,000 troops on the Ukraine border, the US calls for cautious. Top diplomat of the European Union Josep Borrell on April 19 said Russia is concentrating more than 150,000 troops on the border of Ukraine and Crimea, the most ever. There are more than 150,000 Russian troops gathered on the Ukraine and Crimea border. The risk of escalating tensions exists, said Josep Borrell, but declined to source the number. Mr. Borrell, the EU's senior representative for foreign policy and security, said there are no plans for economic sanctions or the expulsion of Russian diplomats at the moment, despite asserting that Russia's strengthening military on the Ukrainian border is the largest ever. In Washington, USA, the Pentagon said that the number of Russian troops gathered at the border with Ukraine was greater than in 2014, and it was not clear if it was for training purposes. The Reuters news agency quoted an unnamed U.S. official as saying that Russian forces numbered in the tens of thousands, but did not know about the intelligence as up to 150,000 Russian troops. Ukrainian Foreign Minister Dmitry Kuleba, in a speech to EU foreign ministers, urged the EU to impose new sanctions on Russia. On the same day, the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, called on airlines to be very cautious when flying near the Russian-Ukraine border, citing potential risks of flight safety. In a statement to U.S. airlines, the FAA noted escalating regional tensions between Russia and Ukraine could lead to sudden cross-border skirmishes, increased military operations, or conflicts. Since 2014, the FAA has banned U.S. civil aviation activities in areas around the Russia-Ukraine border. The notice also requires airlines to provide at least 72 hours prior notice to the FAA of scheduled flights in the region. The FAA and other aviation regulators are concerned about the possibility of a civil aircraft being shot down in the area during a conflict by mistake. In 2014, Malaysia Airlines flight MH17 was flying from Amsterdam, Netherlands, to Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, when it was shot down in eastern Ukraine by a missile fired from the territory by SLAB, international investigators said. Russian troops hold in skirmish with the Ukrainian government army. All 298 people on board were killed two-thirds of which were Dutch nationals.